Hello friend, <laughs> how are you today? Are you doing great? Are you keep smiling? Are you maintaining your positive vibe? And are you happy? I am happy to see you. That's definitely true. And I hope you're doing great, all right? So I would like to tell you something that I would like to have you to suggest me some nicknames for yourself. So I would like to have you as my fans and I would like to call you not just a friend but some specific nickname. Let's say Lady Gaga's fans are little monsters, right? So when she greets them she can say hello my little monsters, right? I would like to do the same. So I would like to call you, let's say, Lions. I would like to hello Lions. Your um, suggestions will be appreciated so don't forget to subscribe to my channel and give me the thumbs up and of course let me know down below in the comments how would you like me to call you um, lions eagles pandas fox well it's your decision and i'll think about it as well you know what I am so excited. You know what? The, the mic is so heavy and sometimes it's difficult to put it on the clothes I have. Well, anyway, I am so excited about my friend. She's going to give a birth to a child. Ha ha ha. Since she's, uh, since she's going to do that, we uh, talk a lot about how to raise a child, how to avoid all the mistakes as a parent, how to be you know how to find the balance between a good parent and um, to raise a child as a good person that's the goal and today she asked me let me tell you uh, well, let me tell you exactly so she asked me um, what did i want from my parents most of all as a child and i told her that hmm, Probably I would like to say that my parents were my parents were perfect and they are still perfect. But as a child I wanted probably spend more time with me. That's what I wanted. They were spending a lot of time with me, but still I think I wanted them to spend more time with me. And you know why? I know they were so young and my mother was i'm 31 years old and when my mother was 31 i was already nine years old can you imagine can you imagine i have i am having a nine year old child right now i cannot i am not ready i am a child i am still trying to uh you know push my responsibilities to someone else <laughs> i'm kidding of course i am a grown-up and i um, I already took the responsibility um, for my life on myself, but I am not ready to raise a child right now. I think we're not ready at any age of the life, but it just happens. Anyway, I am so happy for her and I am trying to explain you why I wanted my parents to spend more time with me. Um, they were young and they were trying to probably find themselves in this life and yet it was difficult for them, I believe them and I think they, they have done the best they could have done. Yeah. Thank you so much, I appreciate everything what they've done for me and I'm so grateful for my parents, they are the best. And another thing I would like from them is a little maybe push from them uh like sometimes as a child i was doing some stuff and then in a certain time i have decided to quit something like i didn't like it anymore or it's not interested for me or it was too hard to achieve some certain goal and i wanted from them like oh yeah don't give up you you can do that uh, let's do that something like that so I think as a parent I would be a little more persistent 
but not too much yes you always you always have to find the balance between you know that being a good parent and not a bad one to be a loving parent and every time you hug your child uh, feel like a notion of love and I think that's what uh, every child want from their parents to be loved no matter what so I think that's pretty much that's it and again thank you so much uh, my the best parents um, I've ever imagined to have <laughs> Another thing I would like to tell you, today I went to the ATM and I saw this message. It's, it's gonna be right here, I'll show you this message. I took a picture of this and the picture is telling me that happy anniversary, thank you for four years with, with us, we appreciate your business and thank you so much. Um, as well but you reminded me that day that I opened the account I remember that day I was devastated I was broken-hearted I was broken as a person I didn't know who I am and who I was but what I'm trying to say that sometimes we have um, a little problem but I think we have to think about the problem as an opportunity um, because yes it was four years ago and today I remember that day and I laugh about that um, so if you have a problem right now and you think that's probably the end of your life and um, you you're gonna die because of this problem Think about that you're gonna laugh about that in a few years, even probably in a few weeks. So I am laughing about this and I'm smiling so hard right now because of this day. I remember that I went out from the, from the office with a smile that I opened the account and I've decided to change my life completely and I was the, the newborn as a child who just started his new path and he has decided that he's gonna do whatever he wants to do in this life and follow his dream and four years after <laughs> four years later um, I'm still here and I still pursuing my dream and I keep dreaming and I when I achieve a certain thing I set a new goal for me for myself and I go there and I never give up and that's the push that I give myself right now <laughs> instead of the instead of the parents instead of parents giving me that push uh, when I was a child I give that push to myself right now so Ilya go ahead never give up and follow your dream and you guys keep smiling follow your dream and hope to see you soon again all right and I'll give you that love for me and love you all um, so think about your nickname i would like to have um, you to be called by a um, known nickname and uh, all my fans will be happy and you are happy you are already happy and i share that happiness with you and i share my love with you oh yeah well see you soon all right <laughs>